Big chap alien, we'll throw him over here. He is, get you. And then another xenomorph. This is the uh, runner alien. Fire team elite. Biggest tail in the shot, somewhat. There we go. Hello! Today on the channel, we're going to be unboxing Alien Prototype Suit. This is a NECA figure. Uh, yeah. Uh, I saw this at a Target a while back and uh, thought, yeah, you know, it's kind of cool, but I don't know if I'll get it. But then I found it at a recent Target, and it's finding, I'm finding that this figure is getting harder to get. Not that I really wanted to have it, but I was like, you know what, it's kind of cool. And uh, just to have it on the shelf, it almost kind of looks like an albino alien. So I'm kind of curious to get in a box to see what it totally looks like next to another alien figure. So yeah, I don't know. I just kind of grabbed it on a whim, but there it is. Let's go ahead and flip it to the back of the box. There it is. And then the first side, right there, if it's gonna stay. Right there looks good. And we'll go to the next side. There it is, I think it's the exact same thing as the last side, but there it is. And then we'll get a view from the top. Let me get this stand out of the way. All right, so it does have a 40th anniversary of Aliens. Alien, I should say. It is. And then the bottom is your barcode legalese. Mine, this is how I found it. It was kind of ripped like that, so it is what it is. And then I'm going to come into the barcode in case you need it for anything. And then somebody did tell me on the NECA figures, this uh, code above, the last two dig digits uh, coincide with the year. So this must have come out in 2020. So if that's correct, I believe it is. All right, let's set it here. Let me get this camera in a better spot. Get this stand out of here again. Coming on down. Somewhere around in here. Looks pretty good, we'll come back. We'll go ahead and check out the box art and everything and then we'll get it completely unboxed. All right, let's get a good focus going. There he is in there, prototype suit alien. Pretty cool. Guessing when they first started working on the movie, they had a white prototype suit they used to kind of figure out how the heck they're going to make that thing work. And there, there it is. There's the bottom of the box. And the back. There's a looking like a like a retro NECA. Retro NECA logo is what I'm trying to say. There's your alien again. There it is. I, I can't wait to get this out because this looks pretty cool to me. All right, I'm going to come back because this is a lot to read. If you would like to read it, there it is. And there's the bottom. There were other figures that you could get from the first Alien movie. Bishop and and uh, Aliens. <laughs> I can't remember Ripley. Ripley over here, of course. And I don't remember any of these others. I don't remember their names. Uh, but yeah, they're there. Okay, let's set it here. Get a tilt down. And get focused. I'm going to grab my X-Acto knife so I can cut this tape. While I'm doing that, just want to say if you're enjoying this video, if you could give it a like. If you enjoy action figure unboxings, toy hands, shelf tours, everything fun, action figure related, and you have not subscribed to Hey, What That on My Shelf, go ahead and do that, and you'll get all that goodness in your feed. Okay, good. I thought maybe I cut myself. I'm good. No blood. <laughs> all right. Um, I don't know. Did I say... Uh, yeah, if you have a fun comment, that's also greatly appreciated. All right, with that said, let's get this prototype alien suit out of the box. Zip it on out. All right. Got some ties to cut. I know these are the ones that are more of a twist tie, but I cut them anyway. I think that should do it. Three. Heck yeah. So no accessories with this guy, which is kind of weird, but... He's cool. He almost looks like a butterscotch color. I don't know. Let me get a better view of him. Something like this. But yeah, he's kind of a... I don't know. When you see him in person, it's shiny. It reminds me of a butterscotch candy. I don't know. <laughs> he looks cool. Man. 
All right, let's bring them closer. Let me get a better focus, and then we'll go ahead and check out some articulation. So with the mouths on these figures, they open up, and you can pop that out. Blah! Love it. Extra mouth. Um, for the head, it is just on a ball joint. You do have these little uh, tendril pieces that are connected that you can't go too far with, but it gives you enough range of motion, so that's good. But yeah, you got your ball joint there, so it's up and then down. And you get a little side-to-side -side action. Looks great. Something's scraping. Okay, his tail is a bendy wire, and it's like scraping the uh, tripod. Let's move it back. All right, the shoulder is just a peg on a rocker, so you're going to be able to swivel it and uh, rock it wherever you need to. Um, you have a double-jointed elbow. It is a double peg on a rocker. So you've got your rocker. Yep, so you got your, your rocker, your rocker, and a peg and a peg. So you can swivel it, and you can rock both sides up. Works pretty well. Did I just... I felt weird when I hit the head like it wasn't connected. No, it's good. All right, so that's the elbow. The hand is just an up and down, but it can also swivel. The waist is all going to be movement up in here. It is a hula hoop. Big ball joint right there. So there's your back. There's your forward. Side to side action. Then down below, you've got yourself a ball joint right down in there. There's the kick to the side. And you kick forward. And then your alien kick back. Your xenomorph back. There it is. All right. Then your knee is the same as the elbow, I think. Yes. Double jointed the same way. The only deal is this one has a, a pin in it for some reason. So the bottom has a pin. And I think this is the same uh, mold as the other alien and aliens figures. And they all have a pig, uh, pin right there, too. So no pins in the arms, but there is a pin in the leg. The foot is a front facing pin on the rocker get it where you need to and it does have toe articulation too so up and down there is a pin in that as well so four total pins in this figure two in the toes two in the knees all right he is cool looking though look at that sucker that's cool i'd like to get him in a decent looking pose i guess i think he's coming after you wow that's cool look at that dude that's fun. All right, let me see if I can get a better shot, because i got some other aliens to throw next to him for scale. Let's see. Let's go about right there. Let's move him back. That looks pretty good. All right, so I've got the big chap alien. We'll throw him over here. There he is. Ready to get you. And then another xenomorph. This is the uh, runner alien. Fireteam Elite. See if he'll stay. I think his tail's in the shot somewhat. There we go. Right on down. That's looking cool. Let's get a focus going. Sweet looking aliens right there. I've got more to unbox. I'm loving these aliens figures. I've got a bunch of predators too because I want to set up an alien versus predator shelf, which I think would look so cool. All right. Is that a good focus? I can't tell. Yeah, that looks good. All right, there is your alien prototype suit. Stay tuned for some posing. Thanks so much for watching.